Let me give you a little background about Bobby. He went missing uh, last June, and he belongs to the Preston family here in Great Falls. Well, last week, Bobby turned up nearly 900 miles away at the Fallon Animal Control Center in Nevada. Well, luckily, Bobby's microchipped, and he they found out that he belonged in the Big Sky Country. Well, for the past year and a half, Kyle, you've been looking for Bobby, right? And you, ha you never gave up hope. Right. So what does it mean to see him today? Like, how excited are you to see Bobby here? <laughs> You're pretty excited. <laughs> now, you had no idea your um, family surprised you today. So you came to the airport and you had no idea that you were going to be seeing Bobby today. No, no way. No, it's a big surprise. What a heartfelt story. So you're uh, Kyle's daughter, correct? Yep. Yeah. And uh, what made you surprise your dad like this? Um, you know, my father's always been looking for him. He never gave up hope, and I never gave up hope. Um, I was always, you know, trying to make sure that enough people could see that, you know, Bobby was missing, and we still care, and we still love him, and we want him home. And... And now he's home. It's just, it's so surreal. It's so crazy. <laughs> Absolutely. We've been saying all day now, if cats could talk, we would love to know Bobby's story. Now we'll have more on the Preston family and Bobby uh, tonight at 10. Uh, sending it back to you, Shannon, live in Great Falls, Elizabeth Transu, MTN News. All right, pretty crazy. Bobby was found in Nevada a year and a half later. All right, thanks a lot.